Yeah, this is the kitchen and I need to do just basically a little tidying up um, from breakfast dishes. I don't know, I think I'm just gonna recycle them because I really don't feel like taking them back to Walmart. Um, but actually I should, because they shouldn't be busting like that. So, I don't know. Um, I made sweet potato pie yesterday. So, literally I made it last night and this one is almost gone. I made two. That one's almost gone and I got that one over there. That's a piece of lemon cake and it's just lemon and foil. I was over here trying to do some editing and yeah, so just want to tidy all this stuff up. And we got just this random stuff over here. These need to be washed as for, I'm not gonna be able to do this daytime. I like to um, steam mop or either my daughter steam mop in the evening and then just random little stuff over here. I will be making veggie burgers tonight so I'm gonna need that for that. My carrot got some splatters on it. I don't know, I should get to that as well. So I'm not gonna be voicing over. Um, so I don't know if I'm going to be able to get on my daughter's computer, but I just wanna tidy. And I, oops, and I also want to, um, what is it? Uh, do some laundry, a little bit of laundry. So I guess I can share that with you guys and you guys can just watch me just clean up around the house and get some things done. I have some cheese sticks and stuff in the oven and some fish sticks um, that literally, y'all, y'all know we're not eating meat, but it was literally like three of them and I was not trying to waste them. So yeah, we're going to eat those. So yeah, I'm getting ready to get this started, guys. Let me go get my light because I think I do want to bring a little bit of light in here or maybe open these windows. So enjoy the video. I won't talk much in the video because I don't know if I'm going to be able to voice over. So, see you guys in a minute. here it is like a scary house dungeon but anywho do y'all see this basket i got this basket off of um i want to say was it facebook facebook or offer up the lady wanted five dollars it is a vintage laundry basket that you roll around this is the most awesome thing that i have purchased well actually she let me let me retract i'm too excited i didn't buy it because when i came to pick it up from her house, my car stalled, I had car AAA, all this other stuff was going on, and that's when my hubby was in the hospital. The lady was like, you know what, you can have it. You're going through so much, I'm just gonna bless you with it. So I got this for free. It had two holes in the linen. It's a real linen um, basket, and it comes off of this metal thing, and it holds a nice load of clothes. And this thing right here had holes in it, and Naya sewed it up, and it is back brand new, not one hole in it. 
I'm gonna put these clothes in the dryer. I use dryer balls. I did a video on these dryer balls, um, and I I, did, I don't even think I released the video yet. Y'all, it's just been so much going on. But um, I hope you guys are enjoying this video. If you're enjoying this video and I see that you made it this far in this video, make sure you comment. I love that basket. And if you remember it when you were younger having something, them push baskets in the laundry mat or the or old basket like this or somebody in your family had one, tell me about it. I love this bad boy. Because when you come down here trying to get all the clothes out of the um, one washer to the next and put it in the dryer, I mean to the dryer, it is a hassle because I hate, especially on this nasty floor, dropping something or anything like that. So I definitely love the fact that I don't have to worry about my clothes falling. Now I have some stuff in there that needs to be dried. I have six of these bad boys in here and I bought these on Amazon. I made my own some time ago, but they um, started to unravel and do all this crazy stuff. So I decided to go with these. I bought my mom-in-law some as a gift as well. And we don't use any dryer sheets. As you see, there's no dryer sheets up here. Just a basket to put these in um, when nothing is being washed. But yeah, sorry. Enjoyed the video. Just wanted to come in and let you know that. I love those. You can put lavender oils or any type of oil that you want your clothes to smell like. You can put that inside, um, like drip that inside those balls and make your clothes smell amazing. So just wanted to share that tip. That's a way that you can save money and not have to buy um, the dryer sheets. So I right, enjoy the rest of the cleaning video. Later, Gators. So, I have a dilemma. I have a meeting at 2 o'clock and I'm not dressed. I gotta do my eyebrows and everything at 105. So, I will go to my meeting, pick my daughters up from school, and I'll continue this video. Like with the folding, and um, yeah, just with the folding, and basically kind of ending the video because everything else is basically clean. So, I can give you an overview of the kitchen right now since I'm done with that. So. All right, so kitchen is clean. Kitchen is clean. I have to water my plants and um, finish my laundry when I return. But everything is nice and tidy. Nice and tidy. So, yeah. Yep. All right, John, I will see you guys a little bit later let me go get my face beat all right if you guys are interested in seeing like a, a mini get ready with me um how i do my makeup or whatever makeup i do wear make sure you put that in the comments below as well so yeah let me go get out of this and
to prepare myself for a live cooking um, my veggie burgers tonight and also um, doing some editing. So I'm gonna try to do that because I got a meeting actually at 4.30 on the phone for a project that I'm getting ready to start. So I will see you, you guys later get us and I hope you guys have an awesome day and remember stick to your script because you are the best at it. You. Something is on my. Okay, you are the best at it, Lady Gators. <laughs>